I'm joined today with uh, Angie McLean. She joins me from Farmstead Market and More uh, in Kitscotty. Thanks for taking some time to talk to me today. Thanks so much. So first of all, my first question is, can you just tell me a little bit about Farmstead Market and More? What is it? For sure. Yeah. Um, basically, what we are is we are a local retail spot staffed by us, but stocked by others. So we are basically a hub for local small businesses, producers, um, crafters, that type of thing, just to give them a space to showcase their products, sell their products, that type of thing. Well, how did this idea come to be? And like, how did it, uh, whose idea was it? And then how did it get executed? <laughs> So basically, um, a few years ago, we were on holidays and I've seen little marketplaces like this popping up. They're coming all over Alberta, Saskatchewan, BC, right? They're coming up everywhere. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, that's something really neat. And Kitscotty has nothing. <laughs> like, you know, we're a small town. We're just outside of Lloyd. So most of us go to Lloyd to find stuff. But I'm like, okay, hey, something like this would do really well in Kitscotty. So Kind of had the idea a few years ago and then yeah this year kind of you know crazy year to do it with covid but we had the opportunity at a building and we said okay let's rush and get it done and in four weeks we had our doors open so you guys are open now uh, for people who are interested in coming by and checking you guys out uh what are your hours and where are you located for sure. We are located on Main Street in Kitscotty. So we're the big white building. We don't have signage up yet, but we are located next to the empty lot. And we have a big Santa and Christmas tree in the lot next to us. So you can't miss us. Um, basically, our store hours, we are closed on Mondays, but we're open Tuesday through Friday, 10 to 7, Saturdays, 11 to 5, and Sundays, um, 11 to 4. And you mentioned that obviously you guys are the ones that are running it, but a lot of the products are from other vendors um, in the area. Are you guys still taking applications for people who are looking to become vendors? Definitely we are. We are still under construction as well. So we will have double or triple the retail space here come like hopefully February. So if you, you know, if we don't have room right at this point before Christmas, we definitely will in the new year. So we are always accepting vendors and we will keep those other ones on wait list until we have more room available. But yes, definitely keep the applications coming in. And yeah, we'll keep going through them. And uh, you touched on this a little bit earlier, but I was wondering if you could expand a little bit more about what it's like and how important it is for Kitscotty to have something like this in a place for local uh, vendors to be able to sell product. I think it's huge. Like Kitscotty is a small town, but we are still so close to Lloyd. Mm -hmm. But like we have a gas station with some groceries. We have a little salon. We have our Chinese food restaurant. We have our hotel with cafe, um, a new little cafe just popped up across the street. So we are getting more. So bringing something like this is getting more, more traffic into Kitscotty. It's bringing people out. It's, you know, people are out for their walks and they have somewhere to stop now. Like it's just, yeah, it's, I think it's a positive thing for sure. And what has the reaction from the community been like so far? Overwhelming. <laughs> so we've got woodworking. We have Oh my gosh, we've got Bath and Body, we have candles, we have clothing, we have gift cards, um, greeting cards, we have signs, we have food. So right now in our fridge that we cannot keep stocked, we have old school cheesery cheeses, we have Spiro sauces, we have farm fresh eggs, we have fudge, we have some produce coming next week, um, some beverages, that type of thing from locals um basically you name it and you turn around a corner in the store and you may find it there's jewelry there's just there's just a wide variety of everything a little bit of everything yep <laughs> uh and uh is there anything else that you want to add before we end this today i think that's about it yeah i'm just grateful and thankful for everyone for for the support and come on out to kids and check us out